It is Monday, February 8th, and it is already almost 80 degrees in Los Angeles today. <sighs> I don't want to complain about it because uh, Massachusetts and the East Coast, where my parents and family live, it's like 20-something degrees, and they've got a blizzard warning in effect. But it's February, and it's 80 degrees, and my room is already quite warm, and it's pretty early, and I, um, <laughs> I don't know. The weather in LA is so, uh, it's all over the place lately, and I, I don't, I mean, I might have a bad memory, but I just don't remember it being like this uh, when I first moved here. Granted, it never had seasons. I mean, that's never been an argument. It's never had seasons, but 80 degrees in February, I'm not really ready for it. Like, I, you can't wear pants. You have to wear shorts. Like, it's just stupid. It's stupid. Um, so for those of you who uh, live in Massachusetts, come this way, man. You don't have to live there. You don't have to put up with that. You could totally live in a warmer climate. You know, sure, occasionally the ground shakes underneath you, but... Man, I don't actually know... <laughs> Again, I'm not complaining about the 80-degree weather, but I don't know which I would actually prefer to be in right now. Uh, an 80-degree February or a 20-degree February. I kind of... Here's the thing, growing up in winter, growing up and experiencing snow and having to shovel yourself out of your house teaches you things about life. Getting through winter builds character that you don't get out here on the West Coast. That sort of life, that sort of uh, struggle when the weather is actually physically against you doesn't exist out here. And I think that is the core difference between the East Coast and the West Coast. <sighs> Monday, February 8th.